A new month brings with it a new event month in Red Dead Online and this month Rockstar has finally brought back a huge amount of limited time clothing. I know a lot of people have been waiting for these items to come back so we will cover what is back. There is of course bonuses, discounts, incentives and as always the free community outfit and we're going to cover absolutely everything right now. I do one of these videos each month for Red Dead Online so if you want to be sure to get that why not hit the bell and the notifications and that will keep you in the loop. Let's start with the bonuses this month. So this month is a bit of a trader month and you will receive double cash and XP and roll XP for all trader sales. There's also a triple gold on all trader award resets so definitely worth keeping an eye on them. If you want to keep a very close eye on them don't forget you can always pin those awards. There is double cash, XP and roll XP on all trade route free roam events. And there is double trader materials from all perfect carcasses, pelts, skins and hides. There is double cash, gold and XP on the feature series of this month. And this is the feature series calendar. So you have bow and arrow series from November 7th to 13th. Then you have the hardcore shootout series the week after. The Blackwater series is running the week after that. And then finally the hardcore public enemy will be running on November 28th to December 4th. As always, there's a bunch of incentives Rockstar gives for people to jump on and the first being a trader month will be that traders will get a reward of 25 trader goods for just logging in. If you reach the plentiful material status while trading, you will get an offer of 40% off a novice or promising trader role item. If you complete Crips Daily Stew, you'll get an offer of 30% off an established or distinguished trader role item. And if you reach a trader daily challenge streak of four days, you'll receive the black Awanjila hat. If you craft an item at your campfire, you will receive the red Lister hat. And if you complete a trade route free roam event anytime now before December 4th, you will receive an extra 1000 trader roll XP. As for the week long incentives, if you complete a trader sale between November 7th and November 13th, you will receive the red Awanjila hat. If you complete a trader sale between November 14th to November 20th, you will receive a San Luis Shore treasure map. Completing a sale between November 21st and 27th will get you a black and white Lister hat. And completing a trader sale between November 28th and December 4th will get you an offer of 50% off select coats. There will also be a Thanksgiving bonus week and that will be November 21st to 27th and all returning Red Dead Online players will receive 3 special bitters, uh, plump bird meat, horse meal and horse ointment. Uh, traders who log in that week will receive 3 special hell cures, big game meat, wild mint, oregano and creeping thyme. Turkey carcasses will also sell for 5 times more cash and you'll get 5 times more XP for this week. So looking at the discounts, there is 5 gold bars off the butcher table to help you get on your way with the trader roll. There's also 40% off camp flags, 40% off camp themes, 40% off rifles and 40% off shotgun ammo. There is 30% off trader roll items. You'll also find that there's 30% off the hunting wagon over at the stables and you'll find that there's 30% off the Belgian draft horses. The efficient cooking pamphlet will also have 30% off and you will find that the double bandoliers over at the gunsmith has 30% off also. Over at the fence you will also notice that there is 30% off select pamphlets so it might be worth having a browse there. The free community inspired outfit that you can make this month comes from a uh, witch's look and it starts off with the beige Kennedy hat for both male and female. For female characters you'll find a variant of the Iniesta shirtwaist for free and for male characters it'll be the Corrales shirt. For female characters a version of the tailored suit vest will be there for free and for male characters it'll be the double breasted lapel vest. For both male and female characters, you get a free bison duster coat in blue. And for both male and female characters, you'll get a pair of studded pants. You'll get a pair of roper boots as well for free and the Hells B gloves, which will save you six gold bars. So definitely worth picking that up. To complete the outfit, you'll also get a red dress tie. Rockstar also brought back 25 limited time items, some of which people have been waiting for a long time. 
for the most part, they're the same for both male and female characters, bar one of the items, which is the hitch skirt. But if you would like to see the items on just either a male or just a female character, I'll leave a link to a video I put up earlier that just shows the items on that character. But I will let a showcase just play out here so you can see all of the items added. color speaks to you that's fine you make the calls here that will require gold to purchase do you have some the material on the
And that's it. I mean, I'm really happy with the fact that they brought back a lot of the limited time clothing. I think they should bring back the limited time clothing a lot more regularly. And it would be nice for them to bring back some of the quick draw passes as well. Just to just give some people things to work for and work to. Let me know in the comments, is there any of the limited time items that are coming back that you have been waiting for? I know the morning tail code is always a big request, so I'd say there's a few people happy that that is back. So definitely grab those items while they're here. Also, let me know what your thoughts are on the November update in general. Alright, massive thanks to everyone who supports the channel. I really, really do appreciate it. Alright people, I'll get you.